My name is Charles Morrill, and I'm a guide here at Monticello. The polygraph was invented by two people, an Englishman, John Isaac Hawkins, and Charles Wilson Peel. Peel is many things. He's a museum keeper, he's a painter, but he is also really interested in contributing uh, to technology. This wonderful machine consists of two pens and is connected by a system of levers and all sorts of springs and joints. And when you dip one pen in one inkwell, the second pen will follow along and dip in its own inkwell. The polygraph was pushing technology to the absolute limit in 1802 and 1803. And for the rest of that decade, it was nearly impossible to make it work correctly. It finally did. Peel going bananas at one point, really just tearing his hair out. And he writes in a letter at one point that the faults of the machine are, quote, hid in impenetrable darkness. I think it's just a spectacular piece of engineering for its time. Anyway, Jefferson falls in love with this machine, a device to duplicate letters. Just the thing if you're carrying on multiple conversations with different people all over the world. You want to keep a copy of a letter to catch yourself up, to see what you had written to cause a response. Another reason is it's just wonderful for, say, a politician, because if something gets in the papers, you can say, well, what I really said was, and for a whole host of other reasons. He was always waiting for the latest one, much the way people might wait for the latest iPhone or computer today. I've been able to document uh, 10 machines that he owned over the years. This man absolutely loved the new, new thing. Kids are taught in school, of course, and this is right, the Jeffersonian democracy is based on agriculture. He imagined a nation of yeoman farmers, but he was always looking at the very latest mechanical new, new thing. And the polygraph certainly fit that bill, and he was always suggesting improvements to it. In many ways, I think of it as the hobby of his presidency. He was really, really interested in it.